were lucky enough to be joined by Mr. Brad Goreski. How are you, Brad? Good, how are you? Good. Brad is one of the breakout stars in fashion over the last couple of years. I can say that, right? Sure. As long as I'm not saying it. <laughs> it sounds really weird. Can you imagine? I'm like, hey, my name is Brad, and uh, I would say I'm one of the breakout stars of fashion over the past couple of years. That's like the worst thing I could possibly say. But you saying it is awesome. In any case, <laughs> the reason for Mr. Goreski's appearance here is not just to say hello, but to curate a sale for Guild Man. We've been spending the last day styling out 12 looks. How did it go? Good. It was awesome. So there's 12 looks. They're all different. One sort of unifying theme to me was that they were all Brad. Yes. Yeah. I felt like they were all very Brad, too. I work with a lot of women, and so for me to get my hands on guys' clothes, and then especially clothes that I would actually wear, is a big treat. It actually made me realize today, I was saying to Josh, I was like, I hate all my clothes for summer now. <laughs> like, I want all of those. That's how I want to dress. Yeah. Do you ever find that when you're styling somebody else that you kind of get ideas that you want to use for yourself? Yes. I actually feel that way about the jacket with the polo underneath, with right. the green plaid shirt over it. That's not necessarily the way that I would put pieces together previously for myself, but I really like the way that that looked, and I think that that will be a look that I'll be rocking this summer. It looked really cool and young, but still masculine. Maybe on me it won't look so masculine, but <laughs> we'll just to try find out. <laughs> sometimes, <laughs> sometimes things have that effect. Once they hit my body, they turn less masculine. But that's all right, I don't care. I can still zip up a Chanel sample. That's real Damn. tough. <laughs> <laughs> you have some amazing female clients. Jessica Alba, of course. You don't work with any guys yet? Not yet. Not yet. So who would you want to work with? Well, Ryan Gosling, for me, is like probably at the apex yeah. of cool stuff. He's just been killing it. Lately. He just kills it. It's sick. Yeah. 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 What could you do like for him? Nothing. <laughs> just be like, <laughs> take credit. Wear what you were going to wear anyway. Yeah, and if totally. you don't mind, I tell people I, just, I chose it. Yeah, right. <laughs> I just come in and I go, oh, that looks good. And then I leave. Yeah. He looks like he's got his own style. Yeah, he does. And not like a kit that somebody else has put together with some rules for them to yeah, follow. Yeah, it's in the water in Canada, just so you know. So if I had to ask you for one takeaway for the Guilt Man member for spring, summer, 11, what would you do? I would personally say that whether you're going to alter your pants, roll your pants, I would show a little bit of ankle. So if you're fearful, if you're, you know, it's not your thing, do it in increments. But I think it's a really good look, especially if you have really good shoes, and also especially if you have really nice ankles. I just like a little bit of ankle, it's nice. And if you're not gonna show some skin, show some colorful socks. Why not, right? Those. You really rolled up your sleeves and styled 12 amazing looks today. I wanna to thank you for coming by. Thank you, thanks very much. Yeah. Really good working with you. Thank you, you too, it was awesome. We'll see you guys next time.